Are we gonna shoot this thing or what? Better take off your lens cap. Welcome to Montgomery. It's just a sleepy little town on the banks of the Alabama River. Families live on quiet streets that roll up at sundown. And there's a barn dance every Saturday night. What the heck is this? Forget everything you knew, Montgomery is changing. We're rebooting, remixing, and rethinking what a city can be. About 10 years ago, our city leaders decided this town was due for a makeover. With the input of young professionals like me, they came up with a plan. This is Montgomery 2.0, and it's time for a download. Montgomery still has a lot of history but it's the future we're focused on. Business is booming, from local businesses to giant companies employing thousands of people. There's good jobs that need to be filled. So you can get in on the ground floor now. And make it to the top a lot quicker than you can in most places. This city is really growing. It's like it's a new place popping up every week. Another cool restaurant. It's more great shopping options. And an entertainment district that's always hopping with live music and restaurants. And there's even a trolley to take you from place to place so you don't have to drive. There's over 20,000 students. At eight different colleges in Montgomery. Military personnel from all over the world. In a spirit of growth and enthusiasm that's got everyone reaching for the stars. There were features I liked in the old version. Will those also be available in Montgomery 2.0? Montgomery 2.0 still has all of its southern charm. And a cost of living that other cities just can't match. You can rent this awesome loft for about half of what it would cost in a major city. There are no two-hour commutes and no $10 parking fees. I can walk to three different restaurants right from my house. We're still just two hours from Atlanta. And just three hours from the beach. But the capital of the Old South is now the capital of dreams. And I see them coming true every day. As part of a merge, I'm on the chamber board and on a first name basis with the mayor. At 33, I became the chief financial officer of one of the top 15 health systems in the country. I mean, I'm 29 years old and a stock portfolio manager. I came here from Ecuador 10 years ago to go to college and I met my beautiful wife and now we're raising three children. I graduated from law school in Montgomery and now I work for the Alabama legislature. I came here a few years ago and didn't know a soul. Since then, we've quadrupled business doubled employment and added a franchise. How many places can you do that? Montgomery 2.0 sounds exciting. Maybe a little too exciting. Is it suitable for children? Montgomery 2.0 is a great place to start a family. This school is one of the top five in the state. And there are plenty of other options to choose from. But good schools are just part of what makes Montgomery great for young families. There's all kinds of entertainment options. Like museums. Biscuits baseball. Concerts. Performances. Sports. And you don't have to be a kid to love our world-class zoo. This is Montgomery 2.0 and it's a whole new city. For young people that come here, the sky really is the limit. We're creating the jobs of the future right now. In a river city that's more exciting than ever. People like me. 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 People like me have a solid career path, a real voice in the progress we're making. Like this resource center where I can get help starting my own business. Like this downtown farm that delivers fresh produce to local restaurants. Like helping bring cutting edge arts and music to Montgomery. And there's thousands of ways to volunteer every year. So forget what you thought you knew and check it out for yourself. There's a spirit of youth and energy here that cannot be denied, and everyone's on board. Even that guy. <laughs> <laughs>